but I'm gonna deafen Discord. Why the hell did Quaz not cancel that map? Yeah, I'm gonna deafen Discord so you guys should actually watch the stream. Alrighty, I guess our first map is on Lost Village. Nobody told me the map picks. And for some reason I have to stream on a 45 second delay from Source TV, so we're not able to really see the time left. Also, I was told the cutoff issue was uh, fixed, but last time I didn't. And the map, first map, which I believe is Dallas's pick, will be Lost Village R1. Quaz will then be playing Caverns, also R1, and the tiebreaker will be locked down. Alrighty, since I'm a guest shoutcaster on 911.twitch.tv, or vice versa, I think I got that URL mixed up, we'll be following Dallas primarily. Dallas and Team 911 as a whole very much at home here on Lost Village. Quaz, very much a hitscan hero from Ireland. And we're off. Sounds like Quaz is the first one to get the rocket, which is the focal point of this map. Dallas gonna fall back to back mag. Quaz is gonna stay around the front mag house area. Dallas looking to get armor. Probably gonna either go for a bow or more of that. And Dallas is doing his trademark thing of camping awkward spots. A whole lot of this stuff going on. For some reason I'm able to see what people are typing in here, so I'll just, you know, get rid of the public chat. Wouldn't be an issue if I was spectating in the server, but for some reason I'm not allowed to do that. Dallas gonna get some armor at tank, Quaz gonna be at the crate area. Dallas gonna fall back inside right as Quaz is heading down to now we have a battle here in trench. Bat. Dallas able to escape out of there with 46 health. For some reason there's a whole lot of rocket noise going on. Is he really still guiding that rocket? No, not really. So I gotta do some S and D restart. What a great game by Valve, thank you. Dow's now able to heal, about 96 HP. Not sure how much armor. Gonna have another battle here at Trench. Claw's falling back to the tank. And then Claw's heading to reclaim RPG. We still have no frags, because we're playing on Lost Village. Map needs massive layout changes to be a viable dueling map. Dallas camping does not get anything on that orb bounce. Gonna take the SMG nade to the boxes area now. Quaz going back to the trench area. He's coming out of rocket. Dallas at crate. Dallas now looking to take rocket. Quaz is camping at the crate area. Whole lot of missing each other is going on right now. Dallas looking to get a sneaky orb kill as he tries to take control of Rocket. Quaz should have seen him right there. He does, gets a rocket hit, and mops him up with the shotgun. Quaz holding the rocket area. Dallas is gonna respawn at the yard, gonna go for the hidden crossbow. Quaz regrouping at the tank area. Dallas probably gonna take the armor and shotgun here at crate. Gonna eventually get that AR2. Only two damage there from that rocket. Quaz is able to get another one. Dallas hurt him. And Dallas patiently waiting. He's but Quaz, knowing that Dallas didn't hit sprint or anything, able to pre-fire there. Dallas looking for the nade kill, and gets it! That was crucial, otherwise Quaz could have gone on a huge run. Dallas now at 3 HP. Gonna have a battle here at Crate, and Quaz able to mop up Dallas there. Claws now gets another rocket. Dallas looking for the rage nade and gets it! Claws now holding rocket. Dallas coming down the alley. Should have a battle right here at rocket. Dallas gonna pre fire this nade. He's able to gather the rocket, I do believe, and mop up Claws with an SMG nade. Dallas now in control of the map. Ties it up at three frags apiece. Quaz at the back mag area. Dallas looking to spam the rocket. 
whatever that area with the shotgun is called. Gonna take the orb of crate. Does not get the armor. Closet, the trench area. Looks to be camping there, right near the crossbow ladder. Dallas able to regather rocket. For those of you who do not play HL2 DM a lot, rockets, along with any other weapon, respawns at 20 seconds. And it's a 15 minute match, so there's a lot of rockets to go around. And we got both of them camping at respectable sides of the map. Quaz now gonna move to the back mag area. Dallas still camping the catwalk area above the yard. Quaz taking armor at tank now. Dallas still camping at the yard, because, you know, he's got like a picnic table and I don't know, a couple of brewskis and a rocket. Claw's now looking to get a rocket of his own. Dallas should have heard that. Claw's falling back wisely to tank. He knows Dallas is camping. So if you don't hear anything, just go to the areas you've already been. Claw's now coming up to crate. Dallas still camping the yard. Claw's wisely not using that ladder just yet. Gonna go to the hidden crossbow. Does not do it. Being very smart about the noise he makes is staying a crouch. Dallas able to get a solid rocket there, take about 40 health off. And probably about 80-ish armor. Dallas now only at 55 HP. He took a mag hit there. Brings Claws down to 3 HP with that rocket. Dallas now looking to get health. Quaz gonna camp the ladder area. Gets a mag on Dallas. And, but is unable to finish. Wow. And he's asking Dallas for HP because that's what Europeans do. they just like, hey, we're playing a competitive match. Can you tell me how much health you have left? Quaz, though, able to get a quick rocket gather and kills Dallas there at boxes. Dallas now going to hidden. Quaz going back to the rocket area. Quaz was spamming over at the RPG house area. Dallas camping the hidden area there. Don't know why he would camp there, but he is. Quaz looking the bunny hobbit. Dallas able to get a precise nade there. That was pretty clutch. It is now 5-4 in favor of Dallas. We are playing three rounds. First map is Lost Village. Second is Caverns. Tiebreaker will be locked down. Dallas controlling Rocket now. Quaz, though, able to get a beautiful headshot. I cut to that just in time. Taking control of Rocket now. But then Dallas, able to cover up that Rocket. It's an old tick grenade, nade, and they're both spawning at boxes now, following Quaz. Quaz with 32 HP. He's got to be careful here. Connecting from Ireland to New Jersey. He's going to have issues with ping. Quaz able to get control of the Rocket there. Dallas looking to get armor and whatnot at Crate. Misses that jump. Quaz now peeking from the hidden crossbow area. Gonna spam a rocket, not get a whole lot there. In fact, I think he hurt himself a little bit. Dallas now camping that we should have a battle here at Crate. Dallas popping out with a shotgun and able to mop up Quaz. It is now 6 5 in favor of Dallas. Quaz spamming nades into the front mag area and it's it able to get Dallas, who apparently wants to fuck himself. Quaz somehow not able to finish him off. But then, you know, rockets do, I think, 250 base damage, so that with the splash, easy to mop up there. Quaz is now ahead, 6 to 5. Dallas looking to do some sneaky nade tricks. Quaz going to the alley area. Gonna come around boxes. Here's Dallas there. Trying to get with the rocket and able to finish off with a nice headshot. Quaz at 17 HP will heal the boxes area. Dallas, for some reason, is. Throwing nades around the rocket area, missing a lot of those bounces. Quaz at the tank area. Dallas holding rocket house. Quaz now gonna come through trench. Think about it, might spam an orb. He knows Dallas likes to camp. It's pretty much all you do here on Lost Village. Quaz lucky this is not like Quake and he can just keep switching weapons like that and not make any noise. Maybe they both scroll weapons. They both scrolling weapons? I don't know, other new guy. I wasn't able to ask. Claw's still camping the back mag area. Dallas gonna gather weapons and armor from the front mag area. Claw's able to pick off. Nope, he missed that mag shot.
Dallas going to the boxes area. Quaz is camping trench. Apparently we have six minutes to go in the match. Because I'm forced to do this in Source TV, so I can't find out the time left. Quaz is getting some lag now. Or is that me? No, oh, that's Quaz. Dallas now the backside of the map. Quaz gonna get himself another rocket. Dallas camping the backside of the map. According to Hyman's shoe, whose brother is named Grundle Be Gone, Quaz is pretty unwatchable. And we're both camping! Quaz is camping the shotgun box area. Dallas is camping the back area by tank. I suppose that's back shotgun. Quaz taking the trench now. I'm sorry, Dallas. Dallas controlling more of the rocket. Quaz staying at his spot there. Blew himself up a bit there, and Dallas able to finish with that rocket. Apparently Quaz did something out loud. He forgot the first L. Spamming nades. Didn't do much damage to Dallas there. He's at 81 health. Rocket. Appears to be spawning here soon. Quaz is looking to get one. Dallas is searching the trench. Quaz is able to get a rocket. And Dallas able to get the nice spam or kill there. He heard Quaz gathered it and bounced the orb. In case you're unaware, orbs will track a target if they don't have to deviate more than 15 degrees from their projected path. Quaz now taking the top mag. Dallas heard him. Quaz, I believe, just got a rocket. Dallas going to crate. Quaz should have heard him there looking to get the mag. Does not get it. Dallas then bullhorns back, goes and gets some armor. Quaz now holding rocket. Should have heard Dallas at boxes area. He's going to bull rush the boxes area with a rocket. Dallas at back mag. Gonna go get himself some back shotgun. Doesn't realize he already has full ammo. Gonna try to get the back orb now. Quaz is hearing all of that gravity gun play. Gonna spam a rocket here. Apparently we have four minutes left. Quaz is at 12 HP and then bam! Gets a beautiful rocket curve on Dallas. Quaz at the tank area. Dallas going to crate. It is now Quaz by one frag. Eight to seven. This is the first round of three. Quaz spamming orbs to the front side of the map. Dallas right there above it. Dallas looking to rush rocket now. Quaz is at the back health charger over at back mag. Dallas camping the rocket now. I believe he just gathered that, or was that something else? I don't know. Quaz now gathering the back rocket ammo. Doesn't realize he has full ammo. Dallas spamming some rocket, does not get the curve there. I might block this filter, these people. Achievement announced, right? Quaz looking to spam rocket there. Dallas holding the back orb area, Quaz going up the crate. Quaz camping the front mag. Yeah, he's camping the rocket house right now at front mag. Should have heard Dallas get on the ladder there. Quaz able to see Dallas there. Spams the rocket. No dice. Quaz bull rushing back. Dallas doing more damage there with that rocket and gets the follow up kill. We have two minutes left and another nice spawn frag by Dallas there. Well, nice for Dallas anyway. Quaz again with an unlucky spawn right at Rocket. That's Lost Village, folks. Dallas looking to spam. Quaz is going to go to the hidden charger. Dallas is going to bull rush right under. Quaz double backs. Goes back to Rocket. Dallas does the same thing. He's in the Rocket House. Nope, he goes for the hidden charger. It is now Dallas by one. That follow-up swan kill being huge. Dallas now at the hidden AR2. It's Lost Village. It's hidden everything. He's going to camp that now because they didn't make him do the version 2 or version 3 of this map that doesn't have that hiding spot. Quaz now just desperately looking for a flag. Going to the crate area. Dallas still at the hidden AR2. 
While I was not thinking about it a lot, if he knew where Dallas was or had an idea, he would have spammed the rocket into the ceiling there from where the rocket spawns. Rocket splash damage doing damage through a few layers of brushwork. Dallas still camping. Trying to run out the croc here. Quaz getting a bit anxious at the tank area. I'd be pretty pissed off myself. Dallas now checking hidey holes in the boxes area. No dice. Should be dawning on Quaz. He's probably going to go check hidden crossbow. Now he's going to check the hidden area. Spams an orb in there. No dice. And Dallas is... <laughs> random orb bounce gets him a two-frag lead. Should be roughly a minute left in the match. According to Thorax, there's no honor if Dallas wins. Claws with a rocket now. Gonna go to the hidden. Dallas is right above. And with 10 seconds left, it should be Dallas by two. And it cuts off. We can only assume that, you know, it ended with, you know, Dallas winning. I thought this issue was fixed, people. Yeah, you gotta love how that cut off, yeah. Undeafened frickin' Discord. Oh, we're going to another level now. Alright. This is great. Yeah, I'm gonna read Deafen Discord now so you guys have fun. Okay, we're sending client info. Well, first round goes to Dallas. dun 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 Alrighty. 22 HP at the end of that fight. So I'm pretty sure Dallas won. Uh, let me go into this Discord now. Oh, damn it. There, you guys should be muted now. Yes, you are. Do that. Pop back into the game. So, first round goes to Dallas. I believe Quaz, let's see, is he connecting? Is he angry? Is he, I don't know, checking his pot of gold or something? Doing a modem restart, of course. Well, that lackluster Lost Village map goes to Dallas. Claw's having a point there, but it was in the pool. Wonder why he didn't cancel it when they were picking maps. If I was playing Dallas and Lost Villages in the pool, that'd be the first map I got rid of. No, uh, Dallas is a bit wrong there. Caverns is faster than Lockdown for a 1v1. And it appears they're going to be playing Round 2. The game is Half-Life 2 Deathmatch. The map is Caverns. Dallas took the first round. If he wins this map, he wins the tournament. The proactive Tier 1 1v1 tournament. And it's going live now. Not sure what the delay is on... Oh boy, everybody's IP address is now filling my stuff. That's great. Okay! Quaz able to get a quick nade there. Source TV wouldn't let me stay on him. So I don't know how that nade happened. Dallas now pretending to go for Rocket, looking to bait Quaz, who's at the ramp area. Quaz is not going to go take AR2. And he's able to get a quick shotgun kill there at Dallas. There is no armor on the low ground on the map. Dallas now spawns virtually right next to where he dies. Going to spam a nade. That'll give away his position. Now Quaz is going to spawn by spamming orbs. Dallas going for AR2 should be up in the next three seconds. Dallas with a nice catch of that orb. It's not going to stay there. He gets his AR2, I believe. 
Gonna spam more nades. That's what you do on caverns. There is 17 nade picks up, but with a nice bow from Claw, is able to take a 3-0 lead early in the first minute of this match. Quaz now going to the back shotgun area. Dallas rushing at back mag. Gonna go behind Charger. Quaz is able to get a mag hit there. Yes, Dallas won the first round. I love how I can't filter these people's chat messages and Source TV. Dallas in trouble here. Is at 72 HP, trapped in the sewer. Quaz trying to go for the mag. Misses four in a row. Dallas at 27 HP. Quaz at 30. They're both gonna back off there. Dallas still searching for his first frag. Claw's going to the low ground of the map, looking to gather some spam and health. Dallas at back mag, already at full HP. For those of you unfamiliar with caverns, pretty much all the armor is on the high ground of the map. Dallas now rushing AR2. Claw's not even like getting nothing with his orb, and a shotgun kill by Dallas. He finally gets on the board. 3-1 in favor of Claw's, following Dallas now. Getting the Red Room SMG. Looking to harass Quaz here at the Charger. Quaz deflecting the orb. Nice SMG placement there. Quaz going to go for the barrel. Does not get any damage there. In fact, I think he hurt himself a little bit. Dallas anticipating some play behind the Charger. Quaz able to get a mag hit there. Dallas at 62 HP. But somehow gets a miracle spread with that shotgun. Quaz not really familiar with the idea of ping and thinks that he was around the corner when he got hit. My spectating... Obviously, does not agree with that, but... Ooh, gets a bow hit there, but Quaz with a follow-up headshot with that mag. Quaz now at 15 HP behind Charger. Dallas rushing back mag for some reason. Gets mag hit there. Dallas in a world of hurt now. Quaz gonna go to the Charger. Probably around 150 HP. Dallas now at 46 health, running out of sprint, but has plenty of props. Quaz with the high ground. Probably get the shotgun kill here, and he does. It is now 5-2 in favor of Quaz. Dallas able to do 20 damage with that nade there. Dallas is going to continue to bull rush back mag. Not sure why he's doing that. Might be going for rocket here. Nope, he's going to bait Quaz. Quaz is a... <laughs> should have had that mag shot there. Gets one follow up. And shoots <laughs> Dallas right in the ankle. For his sixth frag of the match. Quaz doing the same thing as Dallas did, trying to bait somebody to rocket. Quaz continuing to bounce and crouch like that. Not sure what that is. No idea. Quaz now actually going for rocket. Dallas spamming SMG nade. But then a bull rush shotgun from Quaz gets him the seventh frag of the match. Well, ninth frag, seven for Quaz, two for Dallas. Quaz now with a full complement of orbs and a rocket launcher looking to take control of the map here. Does not hit Dallas there. Hit sounds are disabled anyhow. Dallas camping the back stairs. Claws at the front stairs now. Gonna go down to sewer. Dallas still camping at the stairs behind Charger. Claws going to the ramp area. Trying to see if Dallas is camping on this map too. Which Dallas is, just not in the area as Claws is looking. Claws gonna do some orb spam now. And yeah, there's five orbs spread out across the map. So, why wouldn't you spam them? Spam's kind of like timeouts in the NFL. If you don't use them, they go to waste. Claw's looking to bait Dallas now with the rocket. Gonna continue to spam. Not sure why Dallas is camping this out, even though he's down by five frags. Quaz is one of the strongest lockdown players on the map, so he would have the advantage going into round three. Quaz now going to take Supercharger. Dallas now finally going to move on it. There wasn't any Supercharger left, so that camping plan didn't work out very well. Quaz is probably at 168 HP. Dallas spamming spam in and around the ramp area. Quaz going to the back little Charger area. Doesn't get a mag hit there. Dallas looking to do the high ground shotgun play. Quaz at 97 health goes back to AR2. Dallas loses sight of him. Goes to the zero point of the map. Quaz should hear him at ramp. 
Does a little bit of damage to Shotgun there, but the orb for Claws gets him eight frags. Dallas now down by six. He's losing control of this match. We're about halfway through it. I don't know for sure, because I'm not allowed to spectate in the server, only in the Source TV. Hooray. Claws gathering armor, the backside of the map. Dallas rushing from AR2. Claws should have seen him there and gets the <laughs> radiator frag. Uh, Claws taking control of the supercharger now. Dallas rushing from Red Room. Does not get the bow hit there. Claws able to get a mag. Does not get the follow up. Dallas at 7 HP and a lot of trouble right now. Claws does not rush. He's now looking to take the bridge area. Ooh, this is a bad situation for Dallas. Low HP at long range. Claws rushing the ramp side of the map and gets the follow up shotgun kill there. It's now 10 to 2 in favor of Claws. Dallas, for some reason, using grenades and pistol at long range. Guess he wanted to eat more of the supercharger. I don't know. Claws with a nice mag there. Dallas is now at 35 HP. Claws looking to chase. He's going to loop around the ramp area, go to AR2. Gets another mag there. Dallas at 3 HP. You see the whole ramp, middle area with that bridge, that's a huge choke point, and Quaz is able to use it to his advantage and gets a nice mag shot there. Quaz then spamming a nade at a spawn point, does a good 60 damage to Dallas. Dallas looking to go up the sink at the sewer area, does not work. Pretty amateur transition from that, if you ask me. Quaz trying to nade the fence at the sewer area, for some reason Dallas is going back to it. I don't know why, it's not like the SMG nade he gathered would go through the fence. Quaz reminding Dallas that he still has a rocket launcher. Uses two ammo there, no dice. And then Quaz mops up at the SMG nade, and Quaz shooting his corpse, saying, Hey, this is for how you made me feel when you camped on that last map. It's now 12 to 2 in favor of Quaz. Quaz above rocket now. Gonna go back down to the low ground, get himself some SMG nades. Quaz taking AR2. Dallas camping the sinks area. Which is a good area to camp when you're in control of the map, but Dallas is not. Claw's getting some lag there, from what it looks like. Trying to bait Dallas with tripping the RPG sound, Dallas not biting. Now Claw should feel very comfortable about the camping. I understand camping when we've been one or two frags. Claw's now legitimately going for rocket, and is able to gather it. I don't know if Dallas has already conceded this match in his mind, or what. Quaz now should be finding Dallas. Dallas unable to get the headshot, able to catch the orb there. Dallas spamming more of them. Quaz able to get a beautiful SMG nade and mop up the SMG. Quaz now winning 13 to 2. Quaz with plenty of SMG nades, looking to spam there. They go for pistol. Dallas with SMG of his own. Quaz still at about 95 HP, and then mops Dallas up with a crowbar hit. Apparently, there's five minutes ago. Quaz looking to get his 15th frag here at the back shotgun area. Gonna use a rocket now. Dallas for some reason rushing him at AR2. Dallas down to 35 HP and Quaz mops him up with another rocket. And then <laughs> Dallas on the bull rush able to get a suicide exchange there. Gonna go for the fumbled rocket. Quaz might get it first and he also gets a nade kill. For some reason had some lag there so I couldn't quite see the frag. Quaz now able to gather the fumbled rocket. Maintain possession. Dallas now trapped at the sewer area and Quaz knows it. Dallas not remembering that footsteps don't work in Source 2013. Quaz looking to bait Dallas with a rocket. Able to get eyes on the target. Dallas bull rushing with a shotgun and is a combine model now. I'm not sure what's going on. 
Claw's now at low HP and ramp. But is able to get Dallas with an orb kill. It is now 18 to 2. With the time remaining, pretty much Claws has won this match unless he has a complete meltdown of his internet connection. Claws able to mop up Dallas there. Pretty standard. Shotgun somebody out of spawn. Claws now gathering AR2. Dallas at the back mag area of the map. Claws looking to nade Dallas to the main area now. They've been able to get the orb kill after Dallas flows back. Not sure why he would double back there. Perhaps he thought because he got a high ground. Then again, Dallas is at a point now where he's got a frag in a hurry. And rushing is not exactly Dallas's forte. So he's feeding kills to Claws. Dallas now camping at the upper SMG nade at the low ground. Not sure why he would do that. Pretty vulnerable spot, which is why they put the SMG nade there. Quaz now camping above Supercharger. Since Dallas isn't around, he's going to get himself some nice HP. Dallas now rushing from the zero point. Doesn't do a lot of damage there. Only about 16 with the shoddy. Dallas going to the ramp area. Quaz taking control of the backside of the map. Gets himself 60 more points of armor. Dallas now at the AR2. Quaz is going to orb that area of the map. No dice there. Ooh, we're gonna have a battle here at the Red Room. Dallas with a good SMG nade, and Dallas able to finally get, stop the run Claws had. It is now 20 to 3. Apparently, we have two minutes left in this match. I can't really tell, because again, I'm not in the server. I'm in a Source TV. Hooray. Claws able to get a mag hit there and follows up with a headshot. Earning him the, his 21st frag of the match. 21 to 3. Claws with a 7.0 KDF ratio. Catches a nice barrel there. Dallas rushing from bridge. Claws at AR2. Had, <laughs> had four orbs at one point. Gonna spam more of them. Has the high ground looking to get the shotgun kill here. Ed mops him up and does get it. Claws now at the sewer area. Dallas orbing top mag for some reason. Claws carrying props, having a leisure old time at the Red Room area. Finds Dallas at the back mag. Apparently there's one minute left, that's what... All these women are telling me right now. Quaz took a good bit of damage there from that barrel blowing up next to him. Dallas looking to pursue. Gonna have a mag fight here. And Quaz able to peek back around and get a headshot. Well, with less than a minute remaining, Quaz will win round two. By at least 20 frags. And Quaz now able to get extend the lead to 21. It's 24-3 in favor of Quaz. Dallas rushing with an SMG for some reason, and Quaz for some reason not able to get a mag hit. They're now going to spam the spawning weapons. Dallas just now gets around to doing the SMG nade, but then wins the pistol fight. Quaz typing XD because he likes emoticons. And 10 seconds left. Apparently it's 24-4. And the map cuts off. Apparently the map ended 24 to 4, because that's what someone in Steam told me. Because again, I'm not letting the server. This is great. Alright, they're going to lockdown. Pretty sure they're doing LD6, but Dallas went to lockdown first, so... LOL. Or as Chris Hansen would say, laugh out loud. Dallas trying to change the map to R6. Doesn't realize that it's LD6 for some reason. Okay. 
So, first round of Lost Village goes to Dallas. Quaz then able to come back with a commanding lead in Caverns. And so we're now at the third map. Final round of the final match. The proactive Tier 1 1v1 tournament. They could have... Is that really what the name we need for a tier in a 1v1 tournament? I don't, I don't know. Okay, apparently everybody's ready. They're saying how they're going to have good luck, have fun. And then Lacey just does start 1v, then she does start 1v1, alright. Alrighty, round 3. Quaz going to the new hall area, is going to head back and get himself an AR2. Dal is taking control of Supercharger early. And Dallas really hates Windows, so he got rid of all of them. It's almost like they shouldn't spawn to begin with, but hey, Fearsome made this map, alright. Dallas looking to get an AR2 for himself. Quaz taking control of the supercharger area. Both players confirming that they're recording a POV demo. Quaz at the stairs area. Dallas still at the bathroom area. Is he really going to camp the bathroom area? Is this really happening? I guess so. Guess he wanted some orbs. Quaz orbing the top hall. Dallas dodging some orb spam. Quaz now at the stairs area. Dallas coming through in the front mag. Here's Quaz on the supercharger. I'm gonna probably spam an orb now. Quaz able to catch it. Dallas trying to spam another one. Does not get it. Hits the railing. Dallas with a nice shotgun blast there. Quaz got a mag hit. Dallas better hope he gets some good aim there, and he does not. Quaz able to mop up with 59 HP. Dallas spawning in the bathroom area. Quaz going to front mag. Dallas continuing to do peculiar movement at the bathroom area. Finally decides to rush the mid area. Quaz going to the back ladder now. Dallas is just a little bit off that orb and then gets a headshot on Dallas for the second frag of the match. Quaz should have heard Dallas, the bathroom area. Why was I able to hear Dallas from that far away? That's weird. Anyways. Quaz underneath the charger area, gonna rush the mid area of the map. Dallas is doing the same. Quaz camping in, miss and get the shot. Does get the follow-up mag, though. And able to get Dallas there with a nice orb in the mid area of the match. Dallas wisely using all five seconds to respawn. Doesn't feel Quaz behind him. Dallas with the orb or bow hit there. Trying to mop up Quaz, but does not. Quaz with super cartridge control. Had a lot of HP. Only about 20 now. Well, 69 now. <laughs> Able to get two mag hits there. On the bathroom side of the map, there are no precision weapons. It's just a shotgun and AR-2s. So, Dallas is a bit out of position there. Dallas is now going to go for Rocket. Is he going to actually do it? He is actually doing it. Quaz rushing from the new hall area in the front mag. Dallas should hear him at the front mag. Quaz is going to spam an orb. And Dallas is going to watch as it bounces right into him and covers up the rocket. Wow. Batter, shut the fuck up. I forgot to mute you. He's just super good. Alright, okay, all tabbing. Alright. Okay. <laughs> okay, back following Dallas now, who is now at 21 HP, getting sprayed down by an AR2 from Quaz. That stray orb does nothing. Quaz at 54 HP, looking to rush and finish the kill. Dallas at the bathroom shot, he Quaz camping that, and then gets what appeared to be a headshot, even though he didn't need one. Quaz getting himself some orbs in the back side of the map. Dallas getting the second crossbow. Gonna try to take some of the supercharger here, but... Quaz for some reason puts delay in that orb. I guess he was trying to slow down Dallas. 
Dallas at 27 HP. For some reason, is camping the front ladder. I don't know why. This match not going the way Dallas wants it to. It's seven nothing in favor of Quaz. Ooh, some brutal SMG nade work by Dallas there. Quaz is down to 51 health. But it's now he's going to charge it up and is at least 120. Gets a nice fleeting mag shot there. No dice on the ricochet. Quaz now continuing the charge. Dallas going to rush front mag. Should have seen Quaz at the top barrels. Does not get any hits. Dallas at 36 HP. He's going to think about charging here. Quaz is nading all in and around supercharger. Going to go to back mag now. Dallas is at stairs, Claws is at back mag. Don't believe Claws got a hit on that. Dallas right outside of back mag now. Exchanges position with Claws. No dice in the shotgun play. Both players are at 98 health and playing with a table for some reason. Claws does not get any mag play there. Dallas going back to back mag to get himself a magnum. Quaz is orbing the back mag area. Dallas is gonna hide in the back mag. Jesus. We're just... Welcome to Half-Life 2 back mag. Quaz is now gonna drain the last of the supercharger out. Gets about 40 points of armor. Should have heard Dallas at the back ladder there. Dallas no dice on that SMG nade and gets mopped up by... An <laughs> by a radiator frag from Quaz. Claw's now getting himself some spam from underneath stairs. Gonna go to the top orb now. There's about 50 damage with that SMG nade. Spam's an orb in the mid area of the map. We're gonna pursue Dallas into the bathroom area. Claw's able to get a mag hit there. Dallas gonna flow back to the main AR2. Claw's is gonna then try to hold him at mid. Quaz does not know that Dallas is at that shotgun, but Dallas for some reason just bunny hops right in front of him. But now Quaz is going to spam some barrels and get Dallas' suicide when he tried using an SMG nade. So, the lead extends to 9, 8 to negative 1 in favor of Quaz. I have a feeling Dallas is going to delete the stream I am doing right now to his channel. I don't know for sure, but it might happen. Dallas rushing the front bag area. Dallas now looking to take control of Supercharger. Quaz coming out from Catwalk is able to get a headshot there. Chronicle of a Death Foretold. Does 30 damage there and about 80 armor, but no. <laughs> no result of that. And Quaz able to get two prop frags in a row. This match is not going Dallas' way whatsoever. Dallas getting no hit on the orb there. Full rushing claws. Claws able to pop him up, and the random orb for Dallas gets him back to zero. No more negative score for Dallas. Claws going in the shotgun closet. Got himself a magnum now. Dallas should hear him at stairs. He's rushing from front mag. Remind me to remove that railing when I redo this map. Quaz able to get a mag hit there. And finishes up with a headshot. And gives Quaz a free air or two. And then gets another spawning headshot. What a great spawn point. What a great game. Dallas getting a bit impatient now. That's probably why he spawned immediately. Quaz giving another mag shot. Quaz now rushing the mid-area bathroom. Apparently there's six minutes left. The last ten seconds will cut off for some reason, though, because we're in Source TV. Quaz camping the bathroom corner. And Dallas able to mop him up by shotgunning a barrel. Dallas is finally positive, gets a frag on the board.
Claus is now holding a filing cabinet. Able to get a mag hit there at stairs. Dow's at 20 HP. Claus hears him at... Supercharger. Dow's rushing with a shotgun. And then Claus with another headshot at the back ladder area. Give me the staple of this match. Then again, it is lockdown. Not a lot of room to wiggle in. And there's an example of the precision weapons having a whole lot of priority there. Pause with another very nice spawn control area. Looking to finish Dallas with a Magnum now. Dallas at 18 health. Claus catching the nade. Dallas desperately trying to get a prop kill. And Claus finally able to finish him up with the sixth shot of his mag. Claus going to back mag. Dallas rushing quite behind with a prop. He's able to do about 25 damage to Dallas there. Claus is going to get about... 30 health from that supercharger. Claws at 90 HP, Dallas at 97, but then two mag shots make quick work of him. It is now 16-1 in favor of Claws. Apparently there was four minutes left. Thank you, random women in the Steam chat. That's nice. Dallas is going to go for Rocket. He's actually going for it. Claws at front mag should cover it up. Claws covering up the ramp, able to get the nice easy mag shot there, does not get the follow-up. Claws going to stairs, Dallas went under supercharger. Dallas now the top barrels. Doesn't do any damage to that rocket there. Does do about 30 with that damage. Claws now doing his favorite ricochet, although Dallas is nowhere near it. Claus really wants a frag with that ricochet. Don't believe he's gotten one. I think he got one bow hit early on. Three minutes less. Dallas in the bathroom area. Quaz is nading the supercharger side of the map. At this point, I don't believe Quaz is spot sounding at all. Dallas now rushing the mid area of the map. Quaz is right there. Dallas went new hall. Quaz is now behind him. Looks like it's going to be Quaz's turn to camp. Nope. He hears Dallas orb in the supercharge area. Dallas underneath supercharger. Quaz at front mag. Quaz should have heard him get that battery. Does not get the first mag hit or the second. Claw's now camping the supercharger. Dallas is at the mid area for some reason. But is able to get a nice orb there. He wisely foregoed the ladder area. Claw's is now throwing random orbs, or nades, for no reason whatsoever. Bathroom area. Claw's with a toilet. Looking for a toilet frag. Does not get it. Blows himself up with an SMG nade. And then misses Dallas, who's able to mop him up there. Dallas with the latest frag. It's his third of the match. Well, technically fourth since he killed himself once, but it is still 16-3 in favor of Quaz, with less than two minutes remaining. Dallas then able to finally string together some frags. Three frags! Quaz going to the back mag area. Dallas at AR2. Quaz is now pretending to go for Rocket. Probably going to camp back mag now. And he is. One minute remaining. Dallas does not get the bow hit. Looking the shot, he rushed, but Quaz gets a beautiful headshot there. It is now 17-5 in favor of Quaz, and... Barring some over-aggression by one party or the other, I think that's going to be the last frag.
Yeah, Quaz is quite the hitscan hero. I don't think he would beat Mr. Yomar Toledo, formerly of NRG, though. But then again, e either side would complain about ping, depending on the server they're on. Dallas now camping the top ladder. Does not get the orb there. Doesn't even do any damage with the barrel explosion. Quaz getting props instead of orbs. Hides in the top closet. Ten seconds remaining. Quaz is going to go to the supercharger. Dallas is trying for the orb spam. Quaz gets two beautiful mags. The last one being a headshot. And finally, the source TV doesn't cut off. So Quaz is the tier one 1v1 champion of the proactive inaugural tournament. Wins the final round 18 to 5. Jesus Christ. So much camping. And let's see, we're on A Marina now. Let's Quaz. He says, You too, mate. That's the band he listens to. They're also from Ireland. And Lacey's like, Send you your demos and stuff and things. Dallas is leaving. <sighs> Alrighty. Let me alt tab. Maybe, let's see. User volume, I'll do that one at 160. Heavy yawns is no longer muted. That was incredible. That's what your mom said to me last night, bro. Whoops. And everyone left the server. We're now following Himanshu, who's standing there with a crowbar. Ugh. So, a very interesting uh, tactical match. I believe that's what Joe Rogan said in the latest UFC. So, about the same thing applies to that final match there. Neo Stigma hopping around now. And both players have left. Neither appear to be very talkative about the latest match, but it is Quaz who finishes first in Proactive's inaugural 1v1 tournament. Dallas from Yuba City, because that makes sense, is able to be the runner-up. Hmm. Well... To the three people that were watching, thank you for tuning in to Team 911 Streams. This has been Stephen the New Guy Hughes, shoutcasting on behalf of William Burrell, also known as Dallas. And also should tell you that William's latest project, EverythingFPS.com, will be launching soon. Do check your local listings for that preview video made by Dark Soul, who's from Chile or something. Alrighty, and nobody in this Discord wants to talk, especially that Medina person. She's making banana bread. Ugh. Well, I need a drink after watching that fucking match. Oh, wait, I'm still streaming. Whoops. Alright. Don't say fuck, kids. Stay in school.